This is Scott Hunt, Engineer775 on YouTube. Hey folks. We're about to get we're carrying started. some stuff into the start. house and starting we're about to, to get started with this rough end today and tomorrow. And build this uh, 13 kilowatt solar battery based system out. We came here a few months ago, and uh, now we're coming back to actually get it done. So this is this is one of the batteries. Yes, okay. one of them. I see the word battery on there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is one of them. This is uh, Arc Lithium. Um, they're a lithium ferrophosphate or a lithium iron phosphate battery. We've uh, put them on a bunch of systems, been very happy with their performance. And uh, we get them from our Amish supplier in Pennsylvania. So they don't cheat, they don't use the grid. So these are great, able to use them in an off-grid environment. Not that this system will be, this will be hybrid, but if the power ever went off, there's not gonna be a problem. So I guess this box must be Amish made too. I might be able to use that to make some nice furniture so Abraham is over here Hello. doing a level line and measuring out where everything's gonna go the first piece of steel has been laid down in the in the area where the panels are going Boy, if anybody ever had to take that back out, it'd be horrible. I, I never had to. <laughs> working on the is that called the trough the gutter box that's gutter where all box. the wires will come together and pipe up from here to the inverter and the tank. a lot of the equipment is in here now these are the batteries and the inverter laying on the floor they're gonna add another electrical box so we can have separate circuits that are solar only. And then that box will be um, things that are on the uh, power grid. Willis is the electrician, so he's in here getting all this stuff pieced together. Battery, solar grid, generator for future load. So that's what we've got the, the um, the template out there that Wes has already used to cut out, so it'll go exactly like oh, okay. this with that gutter. When we set the gutter, drop this guy on there. So, be so all those little conduits sticking out of the top are gonna fit in those holes. Yes, sir. If everything works out the way we want it to. <laughs> okay. Yesterday when we left, the guys had driven uh, the metal uh, piers down into the ground and then we come back this morning they've already got the whole array set up <laughs> we're gonna now they're trenching to run the power over to the house and uh, we're also gonna run a water line down to the 
solar array to have uh, water for animals and things uh, down there. We're gonna capture water from our roof. And I'm learning that with a metal roof, you get very clean water. Um, so that's exciting to find out that shingles, especially new shingles, put off a lot of uh, bad stuff into your water. Plus, when we took down the old gutters, there wasn't hardly anything in them, just a little bit of uh, the particles from the asphalt shingles. So we don't hardly get any leaves or anything going into the gutters on this house. digging. We need to branch off of the trench and go along the house this way because we want to put a, a water tank at the corner of the house. Um, so this blue PEX line is going to go follow their trench almost all the way to the truck and we're going to put a faucet down there. And then we also have a, a wire this gray wire is going to go out to uh, a shed that we're going to build for the telescope later. This is pretty good. Pretty good lunchtime scene. This is lunch on the solar panel crew scene. <laughs> Care for some? Smoke oysters? <laughs> Sardines? Sardines? Mustard? Liverwurst? What else we got that's strange? Solar crews aren't known. And chocolate them. dessert. <laughs> <laughs> we just had a big ring. Some decorating in Claire's room in the middle of the night. These are adhesive mirrors that we're putting on Claire's wall. Since our last video, we've done a lot of odds and ends, like Caleb put in these uh, cranks for the windows. We've put in a lot of these outlet plates, the pot filler, pendant lights, which you probably did see in the previous video, installed the window screens, put in the top of the pedestal sink and the faucet, installed doorknobs. Put in the tub filler. Put in the tub. Put in the master vanity. Put in the handrails. Put in the foyer light. Put in the rear foyer light. We've put in my novelty cabinet. Hooked up the water softener. So now we turned on the water. We put in Caleb's fan. The kids shower faucet. And their mirror. Water heater wall shelf in the office. So this is Miguel and Stella. They are our painters that are fixing the problemos <laughs> from the other painters. <laughs> so these are muy bien painters. <laughs> or muy bueno. Muy bueno painters. <laughs> thank you, thank you, Sarah. <laughs> Gracias. But uh, the way we're set up now is it's running the house and like I hear a vacuum or something come on. Yeah. So it's actually offsetting that. The cool thing the way that I'm set up right now is no grid is being used. So it's zero, it's called net zero or zero export. 
So it's actually running. So whatever they're plugged into and running, I'm offsetting it with your solar panels now. So it's pretty cool. So I'm just going to go over the parts and pieces. And if you have questions, jump in and ask me. And um, again, there's different scenarios. There's the everyday, how does the system work when the grid is up? And then how does it have, what do we do when the grid is down? And so the way I have you set up is unlimited power to home. What was that? You're not supposed to say that. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what craziness is going on? Who knows? That there must be a switch tied to that light somewhere. Oh, oh you're it's doing it. Oh, Cindy's <laughs> doing she's doing it to me. <laughs> Sorry. That's a good way to mess with me. <laughs> you do the same thing. So the know. customer is turning the light switch on and off as I'm explaining their power system. So <laughs> Sorry. That's just the vacuum that's went off at the same time. That's right? awesome. <laughs> I was like, what in the world? So um, back to where I was, grid setup. There are a lot of different modes, which you will be.